I'm Is this lost. a trailer? Oh, it's a trailer. The bell has told on the age of the console. Oh, I want to watch the trailer. Actually, I haven't really seen it. The return of the sovereign. Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. Learn all you can of this world you must protect. Looks we beautiful. Will be spared the horrors of the fell dragon. Dragon slaying could be so cool. From this moment forth. You know, I like Skyrim. Thou art arisen. Parthenax? No. Charge and do. Medusa. Here's my chance. If you're discovered, yours won't be the only head that rolls. What is your purpose here? When twas all but certain that her son would take his father's place. Word. Reach the castle that the Arisen have been found. I wonder what kind of choices we're Pity gonna make in this game. Arisen. Oh no. Why okay, that's super cool. Fight? Arisen. You need only believe in your own oh, I'm so excited. There's Arisen. witch hats and sweet looking combat. Show me the path thou wouldst walk. Quite a sense of scale. The largeness of the dragons and everything, like, dang. If ye intend to do what I could not, and fell the dragon true, I would gladly pass all the wisdom I possess into your hands. Okay, I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm ready. All right, welcome to Dragon's Dogma 2, character creator. We are going to, uh, I don't know, make a character, see how this goes. We can see the trailer, which is super hype. I can't wait for this game, so let's, let's see. Character you, can, you create can be carried over to Dragon's Dogma 2. You can also make edits to your finalized character or customize them from a blank slate using the character creator. Wait, you can you can make two things? You can make your person and a, a a main pawn. Why are they called a pawn? Are we playing chess? Dang. Gotta brush up on my knowledge. She's a preset, I guess. Start with Oh, is it saying that like one of is it choosing one of my own presets? No. Okay, so we have kind of like Khajiits. Wide variety of different people. Okay, we're gonna start, we're gonna start with this lady. I don't know, let's see what's going on here. So yeah, so what do we have? Race or body type, yeah, proceed. Oh, so we can be like, <sighs> Ooh, do we be like a cat person? I don't, I don't know what their name is yet. Oh, we've got like a lot of different body types. Make her nice and tall. Adjust the face to suit your liking by making selections over three stages. You will then be able to use the head you have chosen as a base for further customization. So they want us to choose a couple that we're going to start with. Um, do we start like here? This is an interesting way to do this. Kind of like that, but like... 
Or... Huh. Okay, I'm trying to see, like, which facial features... Kind of like that. Yeah, so like, what can we do to customize it further? So like head, head size. Okay, so we can do like a whole thing. Wish this game was out now. I know, soon at least. Yeah, hair, I'm sure we can totally customize different things, but I'll take a look. I appreciate that it like shows, it like highlights what it's doing. Oh my gosh. Okay, so like. There's gonna be a good amount of different options for how this can go. A depth. Like, let me see, if I just take this... Okay, so that's what that's doing. I'm, like, trying to see... Go out just a little bit. The width. More like that. Short neck length. Maybe just a little bit more. It's looking a little bit thicker than it needs to compared to the rest of her body. Okay. No. Oh, this is so interesting. Okay, so like body, you can like fully like customize. This is cool. Yeah, the full game will be released on the 22nd. Hopefully the night of the 21st, so we'll see. Muscle style. Oh, what a trip. There's like 40 almost. Wow. so interesting. Like, I don't know. Let me start with something like that. That works. Muscle strength. Oh, so you can, like, increase and decrease, like, the definition of it. Make her pretty strong. Like, she's gotta go do something. Gotta go slay some dragons or something. Trap size probably doesn't need to be... Too crazy. Put it about. This is about where it was. So the muscle mass, that's. You can get so specific. Just like a little bit more. And like. Like, how strong of legs do you want? That's so interesting. And then there's also, like, size. Oh. Oh. Leave her about where we were. Lower body size. This is pretty specific. Huh. So like her head posture movement style 
Some people have made some uncanny character recreations from games and all. That's super cool. This is very interesting. Um, knee angle. You can, like... Is this... Random. Posture? Is this how much we're standing up straight? That looks good. Elbow angle? Like, oh my god. That's so specific. That's more subtle movements. That's a bit more animated. Yeah, we'll go with... Walking with purpose, you know? We'll do like that. Okay, so base head. So let's see. First things first. Before I even look at the face, I wanna I wanna look at our hairstyle, because that's it's important. Like what color hair are we going with? Something like that is kind of nice. It's I appreciate that they kind of have like the natural kind of blonde. That's like, yeah, they have the, you know, not everything has to be yellow blonde. There can be yellow blonde, but not all of them have to be. Oh, and all the different tones of the light hair. I love it. Even like that. That's a pretty color. You know? You have dark hair? Looks like it. Got a lot of different variety. I really do appreciate that. There's a lot of different like tones and like undertones for the darker hairs too. They're not all just totally the same, which is really nice. Hmm. Oh, you can have the tip of the hair a little bit of a different color. That's kind of fun. Should I make it lighter? I don't like the highlights, but we don't want it to be like greenish. Let's keep it like that. Okay, so hairstyle. Now this is going to be very important. What hairstyles are we talking? What do we have? So this one that we started with is, is decent. It's kind of fun. I like the braid. No. Hang on. I'm figuring this out still. Okay, so it's the two braids. Oh, I like. I like even more. That's pretty. It's very, like, warrior-like, you know? Oh, tattoos and scars. Oh my gosh. Um... Then here is kind of more just classic long hair, some shorter hairs, a ponytail. I like, I think I like the braids. That's sweet. So let me see, do I want a different color here? I don't really think so. Just slightly lighter. Cool. Machine. What does this do? I don't really know what that's doing. Oh, I see. It's 
basically just like highlights. Like how much highlight do we want? Oh, and you can like move it through the hair in case you want like a specific part of your hair to be shiny. You can adjust like the blend. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, so we have some hair picked out at least, but let me let me also look at eyebrows and then we're gonna look at the whole face shape. Just got these ones. Those are like a stronger brow, I like. Yeah, I like it for now. Maybe just if we can lighten it up a little bit more. Not like fully, but like a little bit. It just like at least looks to be more of the, the tone. Maybe just a little bit less thick. There we go. Okay, face. Here we go. Um, skin. Oh, interesting. So is this like your, yeah, like your complexion? This one, a little better than I think what we had before in my opinion. Oh, she actually has like a little bit of a tan right there. So here there is no tan. How much sunlight does she get? I don't know. That's her complexion as well. Like, yeah, let's go with something more like that. That one. Oh, you can make yourself like more kind of blue or green. Interesting. Princess Fiona? No, but it's great actually like to have undertones like this because people tend to have cool skin or like warmer skin. And I love that. That's that's really awesome. Yeah, and then you can have Oh, like how shiny you are. <laughs> like look it. Shiny. And all sweaty or something. Like, let's turn it up just a little bit, I guess. A little bit of some, some natural glow. Let's see. Wrinkles. Somewhere in the center here. So now, so brow height. So yeah, so these, so her brow's pretty low, but I kind of like it because it gives a unique look. But we don't want like, like too much. Oops, I keep doing this incorrectly. Hang on. Put her like here. We can all see. Okay. Um. Go up to like there. So far, she's like giving me like Galadriel vibes. I don't know. <laughs> this will take you hours to finish. I mean, yeah. This is amazing. I also like how you can go back and continue editing. So your brow angle. Make yourself look mad or sad. That's good.
More like that. Okay, brow depth, inner and outer depth. Oh, interesting. More like a little bit less. Maybe like a lot less right there. The overall I don't mind, but like the outer. Like that, okay. Make enrage, yep. Make her permanently surprised. I mean, you can. Eye height, I don't really wanna mess with too much. Space outer eyes just a little bit more. More like that. The depth seems okay. I don't really want to mess with that. Size, maybe a little bit bigger. Only a little. <laughs> also, I objection. Good to see you. You're going to be playing this one as, as well? Also, so who here is gonna be playing this game? Like everyone or unsure? You just have like an eye closed. That's kind of nice. Could be a cool look. So. I'd like to reduce the width of the bridge a bit. A little bit more like sharpness. I gotta give her, you know, a little nose bump. Coming along. So, like, from here. Yeah, so basically, we can adjust, like, the angle. I like that. I like that for the profile. The sharpness. Maybe more like... Okay. The depth. But I'll just a bit further. There we go. All right. All right. This is an impressive character creator. It reminds me of uh, like an even more in-depth version of like the Skyrim modded character creation things I do. Um. Yeah. No scroll side. Let's just go just a little smaller. I see. So that mainly affects how it looks from front on. Like straight on like this. Let's drop it down just a little bit like like that. Don't want to mess with that. Okay, cool. Ears, I don't know if I have that much of a preference on ears. Do I? Like, uh. Main thing is like let's consider like angle a little bit more like that a 
I don't know. I'm just kind of trying to give a more of a unique look. I have just a little bit of room for some earrings there. Cool. Cheeks. So this is one thing. So there's cheeks and then there's like jaw and chin. So the thickness. In general, it looks like we're going to want A little bit more angular. What is this mainly doing? Make her face a bit more forward like that, you know? The character creator for this has finally come out, but the whole game comes out next week. Um, I think that's a good start. Mouth. The height, I don't really feel the need to mess with. Looks good. Width. More like that. Lip thickness. I didn't be quite that thin, but I don't need to give her too much, but let's that looks like natural still. Maybe a little bit more like that. Yeah. Something like that. Okay. Jaw and chin. Jaw definition. So that's turned like super, super far up. Let's just try working with that. So that's, that's fine. The jaw position. That's, I don't know. It's fine. The protrusion. Maybe something like that. Nothing crazy. Chin height. The protrusion. Just a bit more like that. Affects the way it looks on the front a good bit. We just kind of like that. The width, though, we can make it a lot thinner. Okay. All right. We're getting somewhere. So let's actually look at like eyes. Yeah, both eyes. Ooh. I like the second one. Iris primary color. Mm -hmm. 
So you can get fully, oh my gosh, you can do like a whole, you can fully make like hazel eyes and stuff. You can make something super cool. that and the tertiary color let's make like that that should be fine iris size can make the pupils a little bit bigger I'm wondering why they look so small there we go Eyelashes. No, this is incredible. I'm so impressed right now. Sure. Eyelash length. They're already pretty long. Increase that density. Cool. It's really nice though. You can have it look like super natural. Yeah, you can have no makeup and all. Totally. Looks like you can have, yeah, just no eyeshadow. Choose some different styles. Do like a lighter color here. Something darker, but not too, like, dark. I got purple. Okay, so you can get pretty specific with this. The opacity. Metallic a little bit. Some sheen. Oh, look at that. Give her some freckles. Maybe like kind of subtly. Just a little bit. She goes outside, you know? That should work. Cheeks. Just a little bit of... It's kind of like a natural looking... I just want something pretty natural here. Kind of pinkish. Lips, you can go teeth, lips, type one. You got like two of the best. Which one do we have selected? This one. It's a pretty nice, like, natural color. I don't know if I really want to mess with it. I think it's. Pretty nice looking. Just a little bit. Cool. Teeth. Yes, we can have all of our teeth. Oh no. <laughs> we'll have we'll have some white teeth. That's that's fine. No. 
You guys, we're almost done here. Oh my gosh. Okay. Tattoos. Oh, we got all kinds. Oh, cool. Okay, I don't know if I want one right here. Body tattoos. Okay, first, I see. Edit tattoo two. So hang on, so I can choose, so like if I choose You like choose like something cool, like I don't know, like even like something like that, can we? Oh yeah, so you can put it on your back and stuff like this. Huh. And then you can have it like, oh, that's so interesting. So like we can also have like different things like that. Huh. Or maybe even like if we wanted to bring that back to the front. something more like that and like you make it like a trippy color or something maybe like green like green like we've kind of got a thing going you know the opacity huh that's super cool so you can do like a whole whole thing you can rotate them you can scale them you can tilt them that's super cool. Yeah, so body tattoos, then you can have different ones. So like, right arm. Oh my gosh, okay, hang on. Um, I love this. All right, guys. What do we think? I think I think we should come back and like look at her later. But I kind of like where we're at so far. So like my main question right now. So like okay, also like scars we didn't fully like look at. But like we've got like a bunch of different options and all as well. Now I'm kind of in the way. Right, guys. Oh my. Have I been changing the lighting? Oh. Look at that. I did not know that that's a thing. Oh, that's super cool. You can like rotate it. Are you joking? That's so sweet. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, I love that. That is actually awesome. That is actually amazing. So if I hit confirm and stuff like that, like, okay, so if I hit like finalize, yeah, we've already gotten there, vocation, also let me fix one thing. This character creator is out now, so super sweet. Um, let me do one thing.
Hang on. And like this. Sorry, guys. Bam. Okay, cool. So what is this? So now we're going to choose Fighter, Archer, Mage, Thief. Battle their enemies in close quarters, wielding a sword and shield. Mighty attacks and counterattacks allow them to cut down foes with ease. Wield the bow, striking down foes from a distance. Arrows are quick. Find enemy weak points. Mage. So are we going to be a mage? I feel like we might be a mage. I don't know. Or like a thief. An archer would be super sweet too. I don't know. We, we'll probably either go like fighter or mage. But let's, let's see mage right now. Oh, let's see. Test. Are these ones all the same? Maybe they're slightly different pitches. Oh, sorry. Did I not fully read the classes enough? I can go back and read them, too. No, they're different. These ones sound the same to me. We'll just go with like that. Yeah, so Mage uses their staves to cast a variety of spells. Commandment of enchantments and curative magics makes them a helpful addition to any party. So it looks like you're going to be a healer if you're a mage. And then thieves appear as a flash of daggers on the battlefield, too quick for the eye. Their speed and agility allow them to break through the enemy's guard with ease. I think we've done pretty good. So if we go back to detailed customization, like lighting and all, like I like, I like our lighting. Does she need anything? Like, I don't know. We can, we can edit her a little bit more if we want, but I feel like this is a pretty good start. You know? can get advanced vocations, mage can become more damage specialized and all. Okay, cool. So there's going to be branching paths within those classes. That's sweet. All right. Well, let's see. Anything else we wanted to see? We've seen the tattoos, the scars, dirt. Oh, you can be like covered in dirt. Oh my. Like, take a bath. It's like a teensy bit. Alright. Well, I like... I like the start of this. I like where we're starting. I will definitely be playing this on stream. For sure. For sure, as soon as we are able to, I'll be playing this. Yeah, in the first game, mages could become sorcerers, cast the most powerful feeling offensive magic you've ever experienced. Okay. I mean, that sounds super sweet. That's exciting. I feel like her eyes need to be a little bit further apart still. Just like the one thing that's coming to mind right now. Let me see. You know, we don't want like too much, but like, it's a bit narrow.
Maybe more like that. You can get so detailed. Like, look at the detail on the face. I'm incredibly impressed. Eyes apart should be right about the width of an eye. Right? That looks... It looks right to me. And obviously it can be preference. And, and all of that. No, I still... I feel like I still want to make some adjustments. But I feel like for right now... For iteration number one... Pretty perfect. Alright. Are we finalizing? You can choose a moniker. Wait, so... Wait. Is this like your last name sort of vibe? What is this? By Azura. Make sure this is the final one. Okay, sometimes you can't go back unless you make a new one. That's fair. I think they said I should still be able to make adjustments, but I don't know. I'm not 100%. Moniker for parental controls. Other will, others can summon your pawn if they have you on Steam. Okay, those with parental controls will see the moniker. Got it, got it. So this doesn't really seem to matter too much. Let's see, do they have... What do they have? Are they going to have page? They have photon and they don't have page? Come on. How about rage? No. What's in Z? Zalman. It's a cool name. Zombie. <laughs> Photon, I love it. <laughs> yeah, will the game have name pronunciation, right? Like is that is that how this works? Like are all of these like do you think do you think they have voice lines for all these? I guess we don't really know. Windfly, Winnie, Winter, Valkyrie, Beautiful Joe. What is... Why Beautiful Joe? What? what? Like, what? Is, there, is that, like, a reference to something that I don't know? <laughs> it's a Capcom game. It is a reference to something I don't know. Okay, I'm like, I... <laughs> Ursula. Nice. They better have Ariel as well. Tron. Nice. Tyrant. <laughs> wonder if they have other Capcom games. I wonder. Sagittarius. Oh, we got some, some Zodiac things. Saffron. Got Sandor. Nice. <laughs> Scout. Simon. Wow, there's like a lot of these. I'm impressed. How did they come up with these? I know, but they don't have page? Like, actually, like what? Some of these are so creative. Isn't that name of something? I don't know what that is. Isn't that something in like Harry Potter? I don't know. Paul, can we go make Paul Atreides? Do no, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> pickle? We don't have page, but we can be pickle. Primrose, Princess, Plus. We might have to pick a, a P name. Maybe Pie Pickle, though. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just, I'm just kind of curious now. Like Odette, we've got the Swan Princess's name. All right. Awesome. So many of these are so good. Well, if you're having trouble with a character name, you've got options here. 
So I'm just curious, like, if you should have the same name as your moniker, or if it just doesn't really matter. Misty. Morgana, Morgan, nice. Lady. I didn't notice an Aussie. Was there an Aussie? There's no Aussie. There's Aussieus. Lavender, Lady Lester. Okay, I don't know. I'm just kind of enjoying looking through these now. Let me just pick one and see what happens. So, like, let's pick... Right, like, they may have surprises, right? Like, we have no idea. I'm kind of tempted to pick Azura. You know, go for the Skyrim sort of reference. They also didn't have Rage, which is our, our other go-to character name. They got Freddy. Eclair. Should we name ourselves after an Eclair? Dahlia. Diamonds. Dog. Dove. Dudley. Cicero! They have some great names. Like, what? But some of the... <laughs> Crumb. Balrog. You can be Balrog. We got we got some Lord of the Rings in here, too. We love it. Fun. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go ahead, and I think I'm just gonna pick Azura for the moment. But, like... Yeah, Biscotti. <laughs> Some of these are so good. Some of these are so good. The Augur of Dunlane. Oh no, watch out. Or we'll be here for 100 years. If he starts speaking, right? <laughs> Ada, you can make Ada. Nice. Bye Azura, bye Azura. So that's my question, is like, should our character's name be Azura? Or like, should it, should it be like Paige or something? Or should it be like, Moonshadow? Because Azura's realm is Moonshadow, and that's my cat's name also. You know, is it like a, a last name sort of thing, right? Like... Moonshadow Azura, it does make sense. Just saying. You can also just name her like Moon. Rage is there a, I mean, I'm all for it. She does kind of look like Priscilla. All right, so my, my question is basically like, what is this going to do? Confirm. Toggle equipment. Yes, we are marked as a, as a mage. Look at us in our mage things. Also, just love how we can just totally, like, change the lighting. Like, that's actually super sweet. Okay, finalize character and proceed. Let's see what this does. Character's data is currently set to carry over to Dragon's Dogma 2. When you create a character, you'll be given the option to use existing data. Okay. So exciting! Thank you guys for checking out the character creation with me. I'm super excited to, uh, to go and use this character in the full game when that comes out next week. So I will totally be playing this um, on release. We're gonna we're gonna have a lot of fun with this one, I think. So thank you once again. And I can't. I just I don't know. I absolutely cannot wait. So thank you guys. All right. We'll be back here soon. Oh, my goodness. My goodness. Well, a lovely time. Lovely night. I hope you guys all liked hanging out and enjoyed the evening and all of that fun stuff. Um, now I actually feel pretty ready for that game. I hope you guys do too. Um, still got like a week or so before that comes out if you guys want to create a character. Um, yeah, there is still time. So, wonderful. <laughs>